Okay, so this is more of the same, just more exercises. Determine whether the aqueous solution of each of the salts is um, going to be acidic, basic, or neutral. So again, all we're going to do is take this and split it up into the, the cation. I have barium. That's my cation. So I'm going to make that barium hydroxide. And there's a 2 there because barium is plus 2. And um, this is acetic acid. So I have H and then CH3COO. So this is a weak acid, and this is a strong base. So this is the salt itself is going to be a basic. So you do that for each one of these. Split up the cation and the OH and the anion at H+. This is a strong acid. This is a weak base. So that's going to be acidic. So take a minute to work all these out and then uh, and test yourself. This one gets a little bit tricky because you may not have seen that. That's where you're cutting it off there. Um, so you have, uh, that's the cation, so you're going to add CH3 NH3OH. Okay, that doesn't look like anything we've seen before, so that's a weak base. And HBr, that's a strong acid, so this is going to be acidic. And then this last one will have potassium hydroxide nitric acid. This is a strong base. This is a strong acid. So together that is neutral. We're going to completely neutralize each other. Over here you have aluminum. We'll add the hydroxide. And for chloric acid, see that before? This is a strong acid. That's a weak base. So this is going to be acidic. So go back and, uh, and try and try to be able to split both of these up. Uh, so sorry, take the salt and figure out which one's the cation, which one's the anion. To the cation, to the positive thing, you add the hydroxide. To the anion, which is the negative thing, add the H+. And then look at your results. Do you have a strong base and a weak acid or, or whatever you have? Strong base, weak acid is going to give you something that's basic. A weak base and a strong acid will give you something acidic. So it's always looking like a strong thing. If you have two strong things, so you have a strong acid and a strong base, it's going to be neutral. Uh, I'm not really going to give you two weak things, if, unless I give you the um, Ka and the Kb.